Hi everyone, I wasn't planning to do a live video, but I want this video to go viral. Um, and the only way that it, people will say, actually, um, it, this isn't forged or made up, is if it was live. But I want you to take a look at Bondi Beach today, 20th of March, pandemic. Okay, have a look at that. All right. This is how well we are doing things in Australia, okay? So this is how Australia is looking after us, looking after our economy. The beach has never been more full. Literally, it is packed more than Christmas, okay? So this is absolutely jokesville. This is Bondi Beach, Al. Bondi Beach, okay? And this is jokes for okay this is unbelievable so um, please make this video go viral okay send it to everyone all over the world because this government is not taking it seriously in Israel they have lockdown that is enforced with military and here you've got literally thousands of pe people right this moment partying on Bondi Beach okay so um, I don't think I'm overreacting at this point. I think I've been pretty measured about the whole thing. Um, but you make your mind up for yourself and what you think about Bondi Beach, 20th of March, massive pandemic. Not only that, they let 2,000 people off a boat today without bothering to wait for the the tests of the people that had so we've got 2,000 people that have been released from a boat princess the princess boat which we know um, it's notorious for it and um, so they just released 10 th um, 2,000 people that have been exposed to and now it's party central in Bondi Beach at Bondi Beach it's party central I'm absolutely gobsmacked. I'm going into lockdown. Um, I think the government here is a complete joke. I think that they are idiots. And I hope that you can just do me the biggest favor all over the world and post this video of how well our government and how serious our government is about the pandemic okay this is not these people's fault this is leadership's fault okay they they just jokes for so i'm sorry if i'm going on about it but um i really would like i really really would like this to go viral um we we've got a serious problem in the world right now and we've got leadership like this that is I don't know maybe they actually want maybe they want people to die maybe they want people to be lying down with no ICUs in hospitals I'm actually starting to think that's the agenda because at the end of the day you don't have to be a brain surgeon to work out when the cases are growing exponentially each day and we have Italy and the example of Italy so it's not like we haven't seen what's coming and this is Bondi Beach okay so um, I'm keeping it on and I'm ranting on a bit because no one can say oh you know that was another day and it's not it's not real you know live is live and uh, they're not gonna be able to you know get away with it and I'm going to make sure that this video goes to every authority I can possibly think about. I'm absolutely disgusted. I'm really disgusted. Either these people have no brains whatsoever or they have ulterior motives like um, reducing their population. But um, I wouldn't call this safe for a pandemic. Just try and get everything in so you can see the extent. I hope it shows you. I'll lift it up. I hope it shows you what I'm talking about here. Have a good look, people.
got a pandemic, a worldwide pandemic, where people are dropping off. Looks like in Australia, 20th March 2020. Aren't we intelligent? There you go. So, if you think that we are not going to land up like Italy, well, um, I can tell you something right now. If you understand the concept of exponential growth, and if you understand the con concept of how infectious this is um, and that in Italy they don't have enough beds they don't have enough um, space for everyone in the hospital and doctors are having to make choices that are going to traumatize them for the rest of their lives and Australia is partying at the beach today because it's like Christmas So please share this, um, share this for the good of humanity, share this for the good of Australia, share this for all the thousands and thousands of people that are going to die. And, um, you know, just please share it with everyone. It's, um, it's, it's a very sad, sad sight for me and um, I'm pretty devastated. And just share it around you've all got lots and lots and lots of con con you've all got lots and lots of contacts okay we have power of connection that's the one thing we have that we never had before is power of connection we have the ability to share information so quickly that there can be an impact and there is nothing like proof of the pudding to get something happening people need to go into lockdown and people need to pressurize the government to get their shit together because quite honestly i was very supportive of them understanding that this is a very big problem and it's not an easy problem to solve but today after le after letting 2000 people go out of the princess cruise before they got the results of the people, anybody's details and they have to try and find them. Um, and now I drive and I see this. Well, I don't know. Do you think I'm overreacting? Can anyone tell me if you think that I am just paranoid and overreacting at this point? I'd love, I'd love an answer, anyone. Like, just what do you think? Alan, Terry, Amanda, Aviva, what do you think? I don't know. Anyway, maybe I'm overreacting. Thank you, Terry. I just needed a little bit of confirmation that I'm not going mad. But um, it's weird, you know, because in every other area, we took a drive now to Watson's Bay and it's like a ghost town. It's like a ghost town in Watson's Bay. It's a ghost town in certain areas. And then in other areas, it's party central. So what kind of leadership is that? I have to go. My son and husband are calling me. They weren't expecting me to take so long. The proof there's the pudding. Let's all just, let's all pull together here. Um, I'm not the leader. It's bad. Yes, thanks, Aviva. It is bad. Um, they're not further away. If I had to actually take a walk down there, which Danny won't let me because he thinks it's risky, you will see that everyone's on top of each other. Um, not, I mean, you can't have social distancing in a place like that. Can you imagine how many people there need to go to the toilet, okay, and wash their hands with the same water? With you know, this is not acceptable. Um, I thanks, so, Aviva. I'm not. I'm not going to take a walk, but it's, it's like ants, it's like crowded, it's like Christmas. And people are having a party. So um, it's not their fault, I don't blame the people. I'm disgusted with the Australian government right now. I'm going into lockdown with my family and um, I just please just, if you can just share this overseas, in Australia, everywhere you can. Let's see if we, it can go viral because perhaps then they'll actually get their asses together and we can save a few thousand people's lives.
Okay, bye, God bless, good Shabbos, and thank you for taking the time to watch.